patterns in nature. So these are visible regularities of form found in the natural world. These patterns recur in different contexts, sometimes be modeled mathematically. So natural patterns include symmetries, fractals, spirals, meanders, waves, foams, tessellations, and cracks. So out of these patterns that, uh, that were um, given, we will gonna be discussing them one, one by one. So as you can see, there are pictures here that shows patterns. So they are naturally formed, but they are mathematically uh, recurring patterns. So the first picture, this one, is a starfish. So a starfish is a, a fish which depicts a pattern of symmetry because it is a five-fold symmetry. So meaning, ang usaka tentacle, tentacle niya is just being repeated all throughout. So kalima ka beses, so muna siya, so symmetry. Then this second picture is a zebra. And of course, zebra depicts a pattern of and so mga pattern ang zebra? Stripes. Okay, so as you can see, it forms stripes. Then this one, the third picture below the starfish, is a sand dunes. So sand dunes are the waves that are being formed by, by blowing air in the desert. So, muna siya, basta na kusok ng hangin, Nai mga sand dunes. Okay, and of course, because it is sand dunes, it depicts a picture or a pattern of a wave. Next one is a tiger. So cunning tiger, as you can see, you might you might say that the, that the tiger depicts a a pattern of stripes. So, akong klarohon that the body of the tiger is striped. Stripes. Body of the tiger is striped. But, when we talk about the face of the tiger, kung yung tanawon sa center niya, sa center niya, is approximately the same. The left side is approximately the same with the other side. So meaning, kung ato ni siyang tungaon deridapita, deridapita, ang atong makita sa left side is approximately the same on the other side. Which means, it forms bilateral symmetry. Therefore, in that sense, the face of the tiger is symmetry. Laro na to, ha? The face of the tiger is symmetry. symmetry. When we talk about the body of the tiger, that is stripes. stripes. Okay. Next, this one. On so many siyang picture, this is a honeycomb. Honeycomb, balay sa boyog. Okay. Now, the honeycomb is like a pattern of a regular polygon which is hexagon a six-sided polygon now that hexagon is being repeated all throughout being repeated all throughout without any gaps that are being formed so this one depicts a picture of a tessellation so tessellation next next one will be this one, the type of a plant. Kani siyang naa kani. I don't know the name of the plant. Maybe this is one type of a cactus. I don't know. I'm not sure. But this one, what do you think is the formation? Is this? Spiral. 
Okay, very good. So this is spiral. As you can see, mura siya nagforma o spring, spiral ang formation. Okay, this one is a fern. This is a fern. So when you zoom it in, the fern shows a pattern which is recurring, recurring from the largest part to its smallest part. Meaning, kung unsay purma sa kinadak ani yung leaf, yung leaf, mo unsay purma sa kinagamian niya. Nagamian. So, meaning nagbalik balik rasa. So, in that sense, we call that pattern as fractals. Fractals. Okay, very good. So fractals siya. Kaya parihara siya o shape ikan sa kinagamian ngatko sa kinadak ani. Okay. So this one, of course, cannot clarify you from the picture itself. This is a wave. Okay, wave. So meaning this one is a pattern of waves. Okay, this one, land formation. Land formation nga makreate kung magyadin yung phenomenon. Okay, cracks. So obvious kayo siya. Cracks. And this one is a brain coral. Brain coral, mara coral reef ba? Ano yung pero mara sa buto sa tao. So that one, there is a pattern there, but mara sa gidaso krosa, mara sa chaotic na pattern, and that pattern is wala sa padulingan, wala sa definite nga direction kung asa juk sa padung. So that pattern is called meanders. Meanders. So this one pattern meanders. Okay. Then the last one, of course, is a water bubble. Diba? So, bubble is bubble. Being formed is being formed when there is soap and then there is water. Then you add them together. And that is bubbles. So, a water bubble is an example of foams. Okay. So, let's discuss them one by one. Symmetry. It is symmetry is a pervasive in living things. Animals mainly have bilateral or mirror symmetry. So katuganina sa kong example, the left nga shape or for me tiger is definitely a mirror of the other side. So that is bilateral or mirror symmetry. So as do the leaves of plants and some flowers. So it doesn't mean that one living thing is only recurring one pattern at a time. So there are cases that there are many patterns involved in certain things. For example, a flower petal or a sunflower basically. If we talk about the petals of the sunflower, as you can see, parihara nagpurma ang tanang nga petal sa Sunflower. So that is symmetry. But when we talk about the, the, the seeds of the sunflower, the seeds of the sunflower, by the way, is kanang nasa tunga sa kanya, sa iyang flower. So kanang liso niya, nagpurma na siya spiral. So when we talk about the seeds of the sunflower, the formation is spiral. But when we talk about the Flower petal, the pattern is symmetry. So, may ato ang timanan ha. Depende kung unsa ang ato ang gi-emphasize. So, the same way with the face of the tiger, that is symmetry. But when we talk about the body of the tiger, that is stripes. Okay. So, five-fold symmetry is found in echinoderm. So, one example of that will be the starfish. Of course, the sea urchins, maumaro sa nagpurma sa iyahan mga and of course the sea lilies. The next pattern is fractals. So ganina ang example nato sa fractals is the fern. This one. Fern. One ato na siyang di pa klaro. As you can see, ganin siya na shape nato dire da pita sa kinagamian ah sa kinadakan kinadakan na turma sa kinagamian. Sa kinagamian. Antud sa magkagamay na siya. Unya Maorin siya shape all throughout. Yeah. Mura siya divide by two, divide by two fractals. Diba? Mura fraction. So, infinitely self-similar. 
iterated mathematical concept having fractal dimensions. So infinite iteration is not possible in nature. So all fractal patterns are only approximate. Kaya di man sa tama ka ingon nga, hatod ka nung saaday siya kutok mo gamay. Pero approximately na ajud siya. So for example, the leaves of the fern are only sub-similar or finite to two to three or four levels. So next is spiral. So spirals are common in plants and in some animals, notably mollusk. For example, the nautilus as cephalopod mollusk. Okay. Ako, kita mo anong kanang balay sa snail? Diba? Ang balay sa snail kay nagpurma sa na siya o spiral. spiral. Ang iyahang kuan. Kay ang iyang body musod mang good na from the, to, to the inside when there is kanang, kanang threat to its life. So mutago na siya dito. So examples of spirals. Another example of spirals are the the hurricane or the thunderstorm. Diba, mutan out na sa mag, balita, once na ito yun, diba, ang kurma sa clouds kay mag, spiral. So, those are examples that are naturally formed. Diba, wala siya man-made nga kuan ka ng pattern. Yes. Okay, meanders. So, other, other terms for meanders are chaos or flow. Yes, flow. So, in mathematics, a dynamical system is chaotic if it is highly sensitive to signal conditions. So the so-called butterfly effect, which requires the mathematical properties of logical machine and then periodic orbits. Okay, so meanders basically has no dip, dip, definite pattern. Wala siya klaro juga ayon sa kahit sa kung kung Huh? Meanders. Pero, nindot siya tanahawon. Another example of meanders are the clouds. Huh? As you can see, um, uh, siya may pattern niya. Tunga na ta, tunga ta. At ang iba, unsa nga, definite nga, purma ang iyahang gi, gidipik. Pero, nindot siya tanahawon. So, yes. kung ikakain mo, kung unsa yung purma sa clouds ka ron, maosay ka mga sa clouds. Purma. So, muna siya, meanders. Okay. Waves or dunes. Okay. Of course, this one is self-explanatory. Diba? So, ang kanang waves, ma-pattern siya through the current, the current, the, the current from the kanang ilaw sa yuta, pag, paglihok sa yuta, disper, disturbances sa yuta na to. Kaya yun, pagkakaman, of course, Kaso why mo anang na ay tubig sa balde din pagkahuman hapako na to ang kilid sa balde mubi mm -hmm. ang tubig. Diba? So yes. kung asa siya dapita ka ni hapak, of course dito magsugod ang wave. Antod nga mo at ka kilid. So, and then, of course, the, the, the desert, by the way, wave mm -hmm. hapon ang na, napurma na niya but it's because of the air the air nga ni tayo sa mga gagmay ng mga sands. Okay, this one is foams. Okay, a soap bubble form a sphere. So sphere ang atang mapurma sa, sa bubble. Then, with a minimal area. So that's not possible for the volume enclosed. So two bubbles together form more complex shape. So a foam, a, a foam is a mass of bubble, foams of different materials occur in nature. Now, you might remember that I told you that the, the, the patterns are naturally occurring. Walay man-made nga, you create nga pattern. But can foams be created without the use of the help of a man? Yes, the answer is yes. Now, there are Remember nga, kaning, kaning soap, composed ni siya ng mga chemicals. Nga, mo-create siya o bubble. By the way, kanang, kanang ato ang soap, by the way, is hindi na ang makalala. Ang glasin ni? Ang buwa is... Ang na ako. So, kanang buwa, therefore, nana siya raw material na ito nga nato sa nature. 
Eh, pasod lang, hero, ha? Particular, nakalimot ko kung sa ito nga, nga area. One, one particular waterfall nga, once mga tagak ang tubig sa iyahang tagakan, yun ang waterfall siya, ikafall niya, dito sa ubos is mubuwa siya. So, that one example of a foam na walay, walay gitabang ang tao, pero nakakreate siya iyang kawalingon nga babos. So, again, this is also natural. Okay, next. So, desolation patterns formed by repeating tiles all over a flat surface. So, repeating tiles all over a flat surface. But, I would like to remind you that there should be no gaps and overlapping. Walay mo overlap na tile o walay mo gap na tile. Meaning, itapad-tapad na to siya. So, one example, ana niya, is ka ng tiles sa inyong balay. Example. So, tiles. Ang tiles sa inyong balay, inyo nang itapad-tapad. Dili dyan na ninyo i-gap, disad nga ninyo i- Overlapped, right? So that's one example of a tessellation. Tessellation. Tessellations. Kaya na to ma kita in nature and anakita ninyo na ay mga na ay mga gipang buhat ng tessellation ng project na ako sa ako ang mga sujanti in the previous years. Asa man nakita dito sa karaan ng mga faculty room, di ba? Na ay gipang hang dito ng mga drawing sa mga sujanti katong ero og iring katong naong nila itong og puti and then pagkahuman isda kato siya those are examples of relations kato naka-frame nga dagko kato so those are examples of relations okay next one is cracks so cracks these are the linear opening that form in, in form in materials to relieve stress. So when an elastic material stretches or shrinks uniformly, it eventually reaches its breaking strength and then fails suddenly in all directions, creating cracks. So examples sa katong mga cracks na makita nato in nature are the cracks in our lips. Di ba? Basta mag kuan gali, mag uga gali ang ato ang lips so mo na siya nga ma cracks niya magsigita og baktas kay nagjogging ta padung tabaaw niya den pagkahuman ang ato ang gisulot kay high heels o sa na nimo una mo pa og cracks inyo ha heels high heels ngano bitaw nag heels ka padung tabaaw so mo na siya example of cracks Okay, stripes and spots. Okay, stripes. So, leopard and leopard. Leopard and ladybirds are spotted. Angelfish and zebras are striped. So, these patterns have an evolutionary explanation. They have functions which increase the, the chances that offspring, offspring and patterned animals will survive to reproduce. So, Kaya na siyang zebra, dilit na ingon niya, tungod ana lang nga nagkuan siya para nindut siya tanawon, nagstripe siya. That's what that's one way of defense. Defense, nga dilit kayo siya maklaro, labi na ugna siya sa libon. Kung sa mga stripe, uh, makita basta-basta sa mga kanang pred, pred, uh, sa mga predators niya. Nga dilit siya makaon. Na. So, that that one uh, leopard that's koan spotted, di ba kaniyang picture nga nasa ako so spotted na siya. So another example of or cheetah, a oh, cheetah by the way is ito marami siguro na tanan. Alimot ko kung sa tong basa dagan man sila nga koan. Dalmatian of course spotted, di ba? Dalmatian nga ero. Okay, so let's try this. What do you think will be the pattern of the first picture? Spiral. The 
first spiral. picture is spiral. 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 The first picture is spiral. Okay. The first picture is spiral. Spiral. How about the second picture? Bubble. Okay. Bones. Bones. Okay. The, the, the third? Waves. Okay. Waves. 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 Okay. Next picture. Atong moth. Okay. Symmetry. Okay. Symmetry. Diba? Bilateral symmetry. Atong mirror niya ang ihang other side. How about the the next picture? That one in the middle? Stripes. 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 Okay, stripes. And then the last one? Crocs. Crocs. So, obviously, it's Crocs. Okay, this one. The golden ratio. Again, this one is a. I'm sending a flower. This is a sunflower. Sunflower. Okay. Now, as you can see, kanang nasa tunga sa ato ang sunflower. Kanang nasa tunga sa ato ang sunflower is the seeds of the sunflower, yeah. ba? Yeah. So kanang flower petal is symmetry, pero ang seeds sa ato ang sunflower is spiral. Spiral. Spiral na siya ang formation. Well, na, nakalinya na siya, nakahilera na siya nga spiral na. Ito mo tang! Pero na ninyo ron. Ito mo ka na klasiko. Isa na ang kung ano yan. Lapo ka ayo ha. Okay. So, that that golden ratio is called, uh, is being identified through the series or sequence of number. We call that number the Fibonacci sequence. So the Fibonacci sequence is a series of numbers. 0, 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 30, 21, 34, and so on. It continues. So the next number is found by adding up the two numbers before it. Example, how did we get 1? This one. Add 0 and 1. We get 1. 1. How, how did we get 2? Add, Add 1 and 1. 1 and 1. That's 2. 3 oh. 1 plus 2. Oh. 5 is 2 plus 3. And so on. So, oh. 13 is 5 plus 8. So, what's the next number there for? 21 plus 34. 55. 55. 55. Okay. 55. And it continues. So 55, 89, 144, 233, 377, and so on. So since it's a sequence, dili siya ma putol. Now, di siya ma human. Now, as you can see, if you will, if you will try to create a kanang square out of it, square nga ang unit is one, meaning one inch by one inches, a uh, one inch by one inch. So makaporma kang square. Next one is another one. So, zero, of course, wala kay square nga mapurma. Then one, one. Tara, muna siya, dira. One, one. Next is square nga, tag, nga two inches. Tara, two inches. Next is three inches. Three. Next is square nga five inches. Five. five. Eight, thirteen, twenty-one, thirty-four. Now, if you draw they're diagonal, then they, it will form spiral. Diba? As you can see, napurma rin na siya ang spiral. Maski pag ipadayo na ni mo, the next of 34 is 55. Then therefore, you can draw a square, dirapita, 
Nga, ang unit 55 by 55. Nga, the pakahuman tapat is 89 by 89. And it continues. Diri nga picture, as you can see, di ba, mas naklaro diri da pita nga murag nag-spiral ang purma sa liso. Yes. Di ba, makita na ito nga nagpurma. Nga, aside from that, what is the importance of kanang the Fibonacci sequence therefore? Just to remember the first few numbers of Fibonacci sequence. 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13, 21, 34, 55, 89. First few numbers of Fibonacci sequence and how will be, how will it help in the koan ka ng determining na ang pattern sa nature is just recurring or nagbalik-balik. Nagbalik-balik. So, example. So by the way, the golden ratio is obtained by adding the first two numbers divided by the first number. So, kung ato ta sa mga dagko nga numero, katong kanina, the first two numbers, let's say, 6765 plus 10946 divided by 6765. Kana siya. So, ato ka sa mga dagko nga number. So, A plus B divided by A. And we call this symbol Pi. 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 Delete Pi. Delete Pi, but Pi. Pi. Ang Pi is katumantong kuan. Say. Diba? Ang pi is kani. Ano? That's pi. P-I. But this one is pi. Na ay P-H. Pi. P-H. Pi. Pi. The pi, by the way, is 3.141592653 pi. That's pi. Pero ang phi, when we say phi, 1.618034. 1.618034 and so on. Okay. Now, who developed the phi? So, he is Leonardo Pisano di Goglio. He is the father of the Fibonacci sequence. So, Fibonacci was named. Was his nickname. So, it roughly means the son of Bonacci. As, as well as being famous in the Bonacci sequence, he helped the spread of Hindu Arabic numerals, like our present number. One, two, three, four, five. Imagine, what's the number sa una? Roman numerals, ang number na sa una, ha? Dili pa ning zero, one, two, three, four, hundred, nine. Imagine na, ang ato ang number sa una, kay... I, 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 V, V. Ito ang number sa una. Di ba? Kung 1,000 kay M. Kung 100 kay C. Okay. So, tungod, tungod ni Fibonacci na, na spread to ang, ato ang number nga 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, hantod 9. Then, kung 10 ka, itapad si 1 o si 0. Kung 20 ka, si 2 o si 0. So, muna siya. So, the Fibonacci is celebrated every 23rd day of November. What do you think is the reason every 23rd day of November? Do you have any idea? Ano, every 23rd day of November ang Fibonacci day? Because it, November 23 is 1, 1, 2, 3. And that is the pattern of the first four uh, of the Fibonacci sequence. One, one, two, three. Okay? So, muna siya. One, one, two, three, eleven, twenty-three. So, muna siya ang every twenty-third day of November ang Fibonacci day. November. Okay, now. Sunflower seeds. Imagina. The seed heads. So, kung natin sunflower, kung ipuhon na ito ang iyahang spiral niya na form, 
Example no, kani usa. Tanaw na to ha, unsay dagan sa spiral hadis one. Okay, that's one spiral. Okay. okay. And second spiral. Kung okay. imo na siyang ipon pila na siya tanan, ang ihap ana niya basta patong diri imong tuyok is 21 ka buok. Pero kung baliktad sa dimuhang ihap, balik ka nga tuyok, ari ka padong. Na. Ang ihap sa dana is 34 ka buok. And if you will, if you would remember, 21 and 34 are Fibonacci sequence. Diba? So, muna naka-importante ang Fibonacci sequence. Ni-follow ang mga patterns sa kalibutan sa Fibonacci sequence. 21 and 34 are Fibonacci sequence. Na, the same way as the number of petals of a flower. So, na ay flower nga ang petal kay one. We call that an orchid. Diba? So, na ay flower nga ang petal kay two. We call that daisy. Na ay flower nga ang petal kay three. Daghan na. Pero, walay flower nga ang petal kay four. Pero na ay five. So, na siya, it follows the Fibonacci sequence. Okay, a pine cone. As you can see, the pine cone, kung ipunin mo, pila kabuok ang iyahang spiral, that's 8. And 13. And both numbers are still Fibonacci sequence. So, okay. Now, aside from that, the branches of the tree. The branches of the tree. As you can see, pila de ni kabuok branches ang tree. So, ihap tagi kan diri. One, two, three. Pero ang iyang pagka, kuan ba? Pag pilo-pilo niya ba? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven diri da pita. Plus, ihap pa jud ka diri da pita. And, you can see, that one is Fibonacci sequence. Ihap po. So, Una nga, very important ang Fibonacci because the patterns in nature nagbalik-balik ra siya sa Fibonacci. Okay, the shell. So, again, it follows the Fibonacci sequence. Okay, the spiral galaxy. Diba? So, you can see it follows a Fibonacci sequence. The flower petal. Diba? So, flower petals always follow sequence. Lily has three petals. Buttercup have na tabunan niya. Mm. 21. Daisy has na short. So, it follows a yeah. fun pattern. Okay, now. Appreciation of mathematics. Mathematics help in analytical thinking. When solving math problems, data are collected disassembled, and then interconnected to solve them. Remember, mathematics help to develop the ability to think. So, muna huwag ka nang dako kayo siyang tabang para makating ka. Makating ka purposibly and makating ka thoroughly. It helps explain how things work. Diba? And then it helps to develop wisdom. It increase, increases the speed of intuition intuitive and then it helps to make the child smarter so money can be collected in mathematics when used, used as a profession oh, example nako so i am a mathematics teacher and then, aside from that, there are people who contacted me to be their statistician to solve problems for them, in, especially in kana mga nagmasteral or doctoral, niya pa answer questions. So, kana. So, magpatabang sa sila na ako. And of course, I am well compensated with that. So, it is important in a constantly evolving world. 
So it provides the child with an opportunity to get to the world. So remember that there are Muraglilisod ka ay yung imaginon ang kaliputan kung walay math. Math. So, lisod ka yung imaginon. Especially, unang pagmata ni mo, unsay imong unang tanawon. Cellphone, mo tanaw ka sa oras. Oras. Ano late na baka kuno sa klase. Alas ukso man mo ang klase. So, muna. So, ang oras, number. So, that is math. So, grabe kaayo ka importante ang math. Okay. So, the most important uses of math. So, I think it is impossible to limit the use of mathematics every day in everyday life. So, we will suffice with some of them. Can you use any entertainment game without using numbers? Imagine ako, no? Pagdaog mo, games, yung pagkahuman, kung saan yung pagkahiba kung pila yung daog? Uh, Kinsa yung naka, nakadaog sa imuhang kauban? Of course, tanahon ang inyo ha? Total scores. Imagine yeah. ako ang total scores ninyo kay Dilik Math. Dilik number. Diba? Pating Lisuda? Even the word. The word nga, kana 21. That's math. Yapon. So, Lisud ka ayo o walay number. Lisud ka ayo o walay math. Can you practice any sport without using numbers to learn if you are a winner or a loser? Diba? Or even mm -hmm. counting na lang. Kaya nang okay. mag-counting ka, sayaw ka. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Imagina kung wala na siya. So, listen ka. Ay, mga sayaw. Nga, mag, buhat buhat o mga butang. Kung walay, na. Next. Can you do, can you do your work without using the numbers? If you are a teacher, collect your students' marks, or a doctor, estimate the amount of medicine of a patient. Or an engineer, estimate the amount of raw materials to be added to complete the work. Or even a leader in a battle. So, can you enter the store without using numbers? Makapalit pa ka kung wala'y numero. Di ba? So, no. You know, on sa una, wala. Kay trade trade, raman to sa una. Pero... Of course, nabi trade value bi agi hapon, de ba? Dili ka musugot kuy kung ang imuhang cellphone ilisan o usa ka sa kung bugas, ah usa, dili usa ka sa kung usa ka kilong bugas, de ba? Anat unless imong cellphone is an keypad rajod, as in keypad at all, walay screen. So can can players be organized without the use of numbers? And what is left of the time for the next players? So, muna, lisod ka ayo. As much more, whatever you try, you cannot get the lead of the use of this important signs. So, muna, nga, daho ka ayo o tabang ang math. So, those are the 27 slides that I have discussed. And you can you can see the slides once mo visit ka sa imuhang imuhang kanang platform. I'll, I'll stop the, the, the recording. Ito lang sa ipadayan. Okay. City Learning Club this one, once you will visit your city learning club, you will gonna see. Hindi lang siya ang internet. Nakabutang na na dira ang inyong ang PowerPoint slide, and I want you to review it again because next meeting I'll be giving you your first quiz. Of course, na naman may scores sa karon, na naman may scores katong akong gihatag na activity previously, katong kuan, I'll stop sharing. Na naman ko gihatag na activity sa inyo ha, uh, which is katong Google Sheet ba. So, muna nga, inyo lang tong buhaton, 20 points to automatic. May nang mamundo mo of score daan. Because, kahibaw ko dilitanan sa yunan sa math. 
Diba? Yes. Nilintangan uh, sa'yo ng sama. Yes, yes. And I want to help you. Nga, karun pa lang daan, as early as now, makapundo na mo of Kay, magkadugay ang topic magkalisod. Ano man siya ang math, no? Mura ba o ka nang naanad na sa una ba nga? Tudluan ka o one apple plus one apple equals two apples. Unya kay ang exam ni sir, one banana plus one banana, di na mo ka-answer. Ano man, mayingon mo, so saya nga, uy, banana, matong exam ni sir, uy, kung apple pa lang tato, kakuha tato. Oh, ano rin ba usahay, no? So, <laughs> Muna, na mamundo na lang yung taog, score daan. Samtang sa lupa. Na kay Aron, maka makatabang sa inyo ha. Makatabang sa inyo ha. So, tanaw na ko kung ano ba to. Sa inyong learning club, wala, nag-loading din siya. But just go and explore. Explore your learning clubs. Katong nasa app na to ba? Uh, the City You Learning. Unlimited Learning. This one, the app. Nakasunod na mo, Anita Nan, sa katong City You Unlimited Learning. Uban, Mr. Wap. Yes. Wala. Napay, wala. Oo, yun na sila. Oh. And added to, ang akong gidiscuss ka ron, na uh, sa City You Unlimited Learning. Na added to, ang akong Sir. gidiscuss ka ron, kaya aron, ma-visit ra ninyo ang slides. Ang slides. You cannot be able to download it, but you can visit it. You can visit it on yadayon. Importante dito nga makita na to ang inyo. Makita magod na ako kung kinsa ang ni-open. Nakita na ako kinsa ang ni-open. O pila ka minutos kang nagtuon dito. Na, okay. Of course, di na si Basihan ako. Okay. Nga nung si Kuan man, si Maria Aguanta, kay ang score niya. Kay... 30. Unya da yun pagkahuman ang score sa iyahang classmate kay 11. Niya siya 30. Oh, siya ba sa basa? Diba? Oh. So, uh, na yung milagrong na hitabo. So, muna nga, makahibaw mi Ana. Makahibaw mi Ana ang mga teachers. So, muna Ana siya ka powerful ang ato ang koan. Pero ay mong kabala ka ka, dili man ta kada adlaw mag-zoom meeting. Dili kada klase mag-zoom meeting. Unya. Sa katong wala ka ron, No problem, sir. Okay. Everything, our discussion is recorded. And then I'm going to upload it in my channel, in my YouTube channel. And then I'm going to put the link again para makita sa uban. Labi na, huwag na yung uban niya sa inyo, ha? Nisod. Nisod ka rin sa klase. Yung din nagawas kay hinay ang internet connection. Then pagkahuman, nisod balik. Ana ba? Di ba? Lisod mo dyan ka ayaw. Kasabot ra ko ana nga situation. Do not worry. Kasabot ra ko nga situation. So muna nga atong i-upload o balik siya ang discussion sa YouTube. Kaya e, aron, dilit na lang ka magsige o balik o balik balik o zoom. Tapos. I hope na naamun mo learn karong adlawa. Na ba? Na yes, yes, sir. Uh, oh. Oh, na sir. Atong mga wala na, na kuan kay you may unmute yourselves. You may unmute yourselves. So, big. Can you? Can anyone share her, her his or her, kuan? Can ang learn topic. The, the most salient parts of the discussion. Geraldine. Yes, sir. Ah, sige. What What is the most kuan? Can ang salient topic ng ni mo na learn karon? Itong kuan, sir, kanang about sa different mga patterns, sir, ba? Itong spirals, itong kanang waves, ito, sir, ba? What do you think is kuan? Kanang di, pinakanindot nga pattern sa ato nila? Para ni mo? Kanang, kanang, katong kuan, sir, symmetry of spirals kay, kanang, ang example na ito kay ang katong sunflower, sir, Oh, okay. 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 So, muna no daghan ka yung patterns nga nag in na nagkuan na sa ato ang karong kalibutan pero wa ta kahibaw that they are occurring. Okay. So, by the way, 
you can see patterns in nature of tabugon. Kita mo itong video. The patterns in nature of tabugon. Ako na siyang isend. Ako na isend sa inyong group chat nga link so that you can visit it in the in the channel and in, in the YouTube. Kana siya kay. But kana siya mga patterns kay. Kani ka kay project man na siya sa previous year. Nga din pa man. Pattern jud na siya nga naa sa tabugon ra makita sa tabugon ra makita makita ka dito nga ah naa din ni siya ko ah naa sa gani siya ang mga estudyante nangadto og nangadto og pantalan nangadto og asa to kaya ra makita og pattern before the pandemic na nahitabo ha kay wala na ko sila pala aga nga pandemic so mao na siya so i hope you have learned something and then it's already 904 basi na pay magklase ninyo unya huwat huwat lang ta kay sa inyong kuan sa inyong tanang pagpa-load anang inyong PLDT ha huh? PLDT what who what lang ta kay pero wala pa man asya klaro inyong hang load niya yeah, dayon unfortunately ang load ninyo is 3 gig per day unya 8 gig ra ang ihatag dili 90 so sad 8 gig ra siya dili 90 so what ay mahimo ilaham ilaham man ang decision So anyway, I hope you learned something. Ha, napasi JD Kim go o padong pa sa sod. Yes, any questions? Wala sir. And so far. Wala. Oh, you may unmute yourselves kung na may pangutan na. If wala na, that would be all for this morning. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, sir. Bye, sir.